Hey, Brent, what an exciting day we have for us here. Day one of the regular season is upon us, and we are ready to go. Kevin, really stoked to be with you here tonight. You could not ask for a better matchup. The energy is palpable, and it's fair to expect both of these teams are going to bring it. And now the Lakers starting group. The two Lakers stars on the four. LeBron at the three and Davis at the five. At the guard positions, Russell and Reeves. And it's Vanderbilt in at the four-man position. I don't think the defense does enough out there to bother him. I think that one's all on him. Just a flat-out miss. And this is the attack mindset you want to see coming into the game. Tone setting right here early. Love that tenacity. And so the Los Angeles Lakers get the first points of the ball game. Jokic, an easy two points on the way. Great focus from Jokic. Tough to throw off balance. Here's Reeves. James outside. And it's Jokic with the rebound. I'm not sure how he finds himself in so much space there. He's kicking himself for whiffing a bit on that one. There's the pass to Gordon. Over Vanderbilt. And it's Gordon that time on the assist by Murray. Aaron Gordon is just one springy dude. When he gets the ball down low, it's hard to stop it. Well, when Aaron Gordon keeps it simple, he is a force print out on the floor. And he's learned that's when he's at his best. Earlier in his career, he could try and do everything on the floor and sometimes get himself into trouble. Now it's about not forcing anything and letting the game come to him. And here is Murray following the three-pointer by Anthony Davis. Outside, Porter. Jokic trying to free himself up. Fouled in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway, so a three-point play chance for him. Defensive and he's got his first chance at the line here. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. At the line for your Nuggets, Michael Porter Jr. Michael Porter Jr. continuing to be pressed off the floor with these injuries to get himself righted back and healthy and make contributions at a high level. Now here's LeBron. Pass to Russell. Here's the three. No good on that one. Didn't hesitate for a second to get a hand up on that deep ball. Yeah, you got to like how he hustled to guard out on the perimeter, definitely respecting the shooting ability. And the basket is good. And early on, they've been nearly perfect from the floor. Just the one miss here on their first five attempts. Down low, and it's slammed in by Davis. Great work by the team there to find AD. They make eye contact, and the rest of that is history. Murray, the pass to Jokic. Pass to Porter. Down to five on the shot clock. Over LeBron. Porter, no luck. And it's Davis with the ball for Los Angeles. Trailing by two. Pass to Reeves. Over Caldwell Pope. The rebound by Caldwell Pope. For Denver, they've gotten four of six field goal attempts to drop in the first quarter. And for the last several years, Brent, the Nuggets have been a top-passing team in the NBA. Now, such a huge part of their success. They're an unselfish team. It's so hard to defend guys who are not only willing to move, but willing to give up the ball to guys on the move. And that's what they do. Such a cohesive unit here for the Denver Nuggets. In the corner, it's James. And there's the pass to Reeves. No luck that time in the shot that would have put them on top. Outside, Porter. Good D by LeBron. How about the timing he shows there to challenge that shot? Yeah, not easy to do there. And that's a guy that you can tell takes every possession defensively very seriously. Now here's James following the miss by Michael Porter. 
Two minutes Here's Reeves. Two minutes. And it's Denver with the rebound. You have to really like his energy getting to the rim there. Shot that he blew the dunk, but you know most times he's going to posterize his man. Here's Murray. Another miss, and they've really hit a rough patch here. L.A. is gone, just one of four from three-point range here in the first. LeBron kicks to Russell. He dishes it to Davis. LeBron outside. And again, the Lakers no good. And one player sometimes can drag down your offense, and he seems to be an anchor here in this group. Gordon against Davis. Reeves the pass to James. Here's Reeves. Pass to Vanderbilt. James against Murray. No good there off the double clutch. And there hasn't been anything easy for him in this period. No, I haven't seen him in, in comfortable spots or at least spots we've seen in this offensive set that are allowing him to settle in. Lakers trail by four. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. Loads it up for Davis, and Davis throws it down. Assisted Superb by. pick and roll action Reeves. capped off with a perfect pass to the slashing AD. Leads to the easy deuce. Russell against Murray. Nineteen seconds left in the first. Gordon kicks to Caldwell Pope. But Trey Vanderbilt with the rebound. Having a hand up in your face makes such a difference to a shooter. Yeah, as good as you can do without getting a block there. A good close contest so far as we finish the first quarter. Nuggets lead by two. And we'll get going after this from Ball Arena. And if you're just tuning in, it's been a pretty even game through the first quarter. A chance to catch up on some numbers here. The scoring breakdown for Denver. Uh, they've been so aggressive, going strong at the defense, looking to score off of that penetration. Well, I want to add also the damage that has been done on the inside. It's a lot of rubble in there, but they're continuing to go right at the defense. The Lakers trail. So for the Lakers right now, Hachimura out there with Prince. Then it's Reddick. Then it's Gabe Vincent. And it's Davis at the five. Now, here's Reddish. He's covered by Watson. And it's Davis with the jam. Sometimes Reddish might defer too often, and maybe sometimes that's true. But also, give him credit for being unselfish. Outside Jackson. Ball's knocked loose. It's stolen by Davis. Reddish with the ball. Jackson on him. And that one's good. Hachimura. Hachimura's got the lead up to three now for the Lakers. Yeah, and this is a tough one to figure out because Rui hitting the three, that makes him really difficult to check. Passes to Jackson. And he can't answer back. The three-pointer offline. Hachimura, the pass to Vincent. Side Davis lets it go from 11. Chanjar grabs the miss. And so it's Jackson who brings it up for Denver. It's a three point game. And this matchup with Los Angeles, hard to believe, just the first game of the NBA's 82 game regular season schedule. Yeah, but this is a team they faced and beat in the postseason a year ago. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. David. Thank you, Kevin. The Lakers remain Anthony on their Davis. grind. Darvin Ham says, I'm preaching Game daily consent. preparation. And the rest you're getting, how you're taking care of your body, sleep habits, nutrition, workouts, recovery, film work, being efficient with your practice time, and your shoot-arounds. Winning habits are built daily. Kevin, 
I'm very tired after saying all that. Back to you. <laughs> I'm sure you are. They actually do all of it. David, thank you for that detailed report. Up top, Hatchie Murray. Davis, the pass to Vincent. And we've heard defensive-minded players, Greg, say, man, everything is a foul now. You can't even touch the guy. You can't defend. So do they have a point? Or? It's getting tough. It? I mean, you can't use your hands. You have to be set. It's almost like they want defenders to be traffic cones. And the Nuggets making a change here. Holiday's checked in. And Los Angeles making a change here as well. Hayes is checked in. Jackson with it. Still yet to score. They need this. Not going to fall. Starting off slow, he misses his first three from the floor. From deep, Prince. And another three for the Lakers. Uh, a good shooter and has some range. Torian Prince welcoming all catch-and-shoot opportunities. Timeout is called first of the game for the Nuggets. And doesn't like how things are going right now. The timeout before the timeout here, maybe just to cut off the momentum and have a chit-chat with the team to settle down. Jackson. And taking a look here at some numbers for Murray. Good season for him last year. He put up about 20 points per game last season. Six assists and four rebounds. And he's a nice scoring threat in their second unit. A guy who provides instant offense. And he has really settled into this role. For some guys, maybe him, they'd rather come off the bench and do their damage. All the energy is on the other side right now. And every miss just makes it worse. The other team is scorching hot, and they come down on this end and can't find a way to get the Embers going. Back to Vincent. Shot clock at six. For Murray. Again, the Lakers. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Murray outside. Here's Chunchar, and it's going to be out of bounds. The Nuggets will retain possession. Los Angeles making a switch here. Russell's checked in. They need this one. And it's Murray laying it in. Murray's got his second basket of the night. Tight handle for Murray. He knows how to create space for that shot. And Brent, what do you say when it comes to Jamal Murray? It's all about staying healthy from here on out. Well, we've seen both sides of it, right, Greg? When he's healthy, they're good. When Jamal Murray is not in the lineup and not confident in what he can provide to the lineup, not so much. So when Jamal is healthy, Jamal's a superstar. It's good. Well, just a sweet passing there for Murray, keeping his eyes open and finding the open man. Russell against Murray. Here's Hayes, and Hayes throws it down. Yeah, I mean, maybe could have tried for a more memorable dunk than that one. And we know he's capable of those memorable ones. Holiday finds Jokic. Here's Brown. Pass to Murray. Five to shoot. Well, now gets need to get a shot off here. Here's Brown. Here's Jokic. Jokic makes it look easy inside. I know Jokic doesn't have the quickest feet or the most hops, but just outstanding at reading where a missed shot might land. 
Pays the pass to Russell. And he lobs it up toward the rim. Oh my Jackson. goodness. Say, say that one. I, I want to see that again. Me too. Just absolutely beautiful. And at the top of the key, Gordon. The pass to Brown. It's tipped. It's stolen by Hachimura. Jumps up. And the dunk Ooh, by Hachimura. And Hachimura read that pass well. Active hands. The Nuggets trail by 10. And here is Murray. Pass to Jokic. Over Haynes. Two on the clock. Jokic defies the inside defense. This is a nice battle inside. It's, it's a matchup where Jokic has the size and the moves to probably take advantage of the defense. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers holding on to an eight-point lead heading into the break. Their defense has been terrific in this game. And we'll be back with you shortly. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Ernie Johnson here with Shaq and Kenny and a favorite time of the year as we're halfway through one of the first games of this fresh NBA season. A competitive matchup for the Lakers in the first quarter. And they kept it close, trailing by at the most four points. They found a nice groove in the second quarter, running out to an eight-point lead. And taking a look at the Lakers, Shaq, what you think? They're running some great offense right now, working the ball in the good spots, taking what the defense gives them, not forcing up shots. We'll see if they can maintain that discipline in the second half. Kenny, what was your takeaway on Denver? Well, they didn't get much from their bench. I mean, that was a big reason why they're trailing right now. We know depth is crucial to any team's success in this league. We'll see if anyone in that second unit can score going forward. And it's just about time now for the third quarter to get underway. happy you could join us we've got two quarters left to go in regulation you look at Anthony Davis in this game he's been everywhere really impressed with the shot selection through the first half just taking what he can get from the defense yeah I'm thinking back to the first half I'm wondering did he take a low percentage shot everything efficient and we've got third quarter of basketball for you two quarters in the books Lakers leading by eight Underneath in the post, it's Gordon and Jokic. Sharing the wing spots, it's Caldwell Pope and Porter. And it's Murray in at the point guard. That's the group on the floor for Denver. But I get shooting under 40% all in all for the game. Passes it to Jokic to the inside and finished off by Porter. Oh, what a look. Jokic already joined the list of NBA's greatest passing big men. No doubt about that. Murray against Russell. Oh, LeBron's LeBron just James. too strong inside. And that solid play in the paint continues here, guys. Murray left side. Here's Jokic. The Lakers with the rebound. And let's head over to the sideline and catch up with David Aldridge. Kevin, thank you. Nikola Jokic amazes teammates with his vision. Aaron Gordon says he's a basketball genius. He plays it like chess, seeing it three steps ahead. Always got to keep your eye on him when he has the ball because he'll find you. Even if you don't think you're open, you're open. He's a point guard, just in a center's body. Kevin? <laughs> that is very true. David, thanks. So the Lakers call timeout their first. And coaches looking to seize every advantage, maximize every possession. Got to feel good as a coach if you make all those adjustments. Pull the right strings. That's what they love to do.
feel some changes. Davis has checked in for Jackson Hayes. And it's Austin Reeves in for Cameron Reddish. And here's James. He'll bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Six-point lead. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the contact. So hard to contain LeBron. He's explosive and clever and unpredictable. It's kind of a nightmare for any defense. This is his first chance at the line tonight. one falls you know, just thinking about it every year the physical and mental toughness of LeBron just gets more and more impressive maintaining his spot at the top of his game no good on the second so he hits one of two the Nuggets trail by seven here's Porter And it's Jokic in the corner. Good and a nice assist from Porter. Jokic just got eight points. Good quick decision from Jokic. Catch it, shoot it, bury it. Pass to Vanderbilt. Now here's Davis. Jokic defending. He muscles it in through the contact and they call the foul. And he's on his way to the free throw line. Such a critical part of how their offense is going to flow. Things are only working when he seems to be on the floor. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. Had a success rate from the line last year of about 78%. Fans, you always want to see the best in the league healthy. Anthony Davis out there tonight. The NBA is just better when AD's playing. The offensive rebound. Jokic. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. He seems to be in the right place at the right time more often than anybody that's on the court here tonight. We see that pay off. When he's not dominating this sport, we know that Jokic spends time with his other love. And you're talking about horse racing, specifically harness Nikola racing. Jokic. Jokic, that is the sport he loves the most. So it's right up there with basketball, amazingly enough. Jackson, he's checked in for Denver. Free throw, good. Jokic. It's going to be a long time. I don't know if ever we're going to see a big man pass like Jokic does. Reeves the pass to Russell. Kicks it out to LeBron. Five on the clock. Fires from the wing. And that one off the back of the rim and in. LeBron's got seven. Would you like to have that matchup? I mean, nobody wants to guard LeBron James, let alone five guys. Still doesn't do any good. Back to Jackson. Gets the bucket and the foul. That's on D'Angelo Russell. Important point there. Got him on a nice play. Getting the ball inside and right. To the bucket. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. At the line and and over the course of last year, he was up over 90%. And with a stroke like that, you see why. The Nuggets making a switch here. Sean Charles checked in. That one falls for Jackson. 
It's been interesting as Reggie has finally seemingly found a home or at least confidence in the way he plays. He's a guy who can carry you on offense and he will score in bursts and those will be very loud points. Now the pass to LeBron. Kicks it to Davis. Rebound by the Nuggets. Jokic has got six rebounds now in the game. Here's Porter and the rejection by LeBron. What a denial. LeBron attacking that shot with pinpoint accuracy. And Russell Angelo gets it to go Russell. on the assist by LeBron. Assist goes to and the Lakers LeBron lead by five. James. Nuggets have gone five of nine on field goal attempts since halftime. Pass to Caldwell Pope. Offensive rebound. Jokic. That shot off. And so it's Davis. He'll bring the ball up for Los Angeles. Outside Russell. Fouled on the yeah, shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. Well, he's big enough, and I think he's strong enough to take that kind of contact at the line for the make Lakers. it an M1. Russell with a nice play. Russell. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. Really a, a good season for him overall last year when you look at the number 83% from the line. Looking at who's out there now for the Lakers. Hachimura, he's checked in for Vanderbilt. And it's Gabe Vincent in for Austin Reed. Good, Russell. The Nuggets trail by eight. Jackson passes to Brown. Here's Chanshaw. Two minutes remaining in the Always going Two up minutes. for the alley oop here. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley oop attempt there. Passes it to Vincent. The kick out to LeBron. And it's Denver with the rebound. He's tried to get it going, but the shots simply have not been there. Nothing seems to be falling. The book is there from Jokic. Not just the accuracy in the quarter, it's his movement and the energy that's getting him on this nice roll. Vincent finds Hachimura. Now Davis. Jokic defending. And Davis puts it in. Davis, Davis has got four points now in the quarter. What a performance on the offensive end. He's making the defenders pay right now for all of the mistakes they're making. Time call here. The Nuggets decide to talk it over. You have to like what we're seeing from Davis. A yeah, smart move here. Talk things over. He's really eating them up, and they've tried a few different looks defensively. Nothing quite getting it done. Zeke Naji, he's checked in for the Nuggets. Jamal Murray comes in for Jackson. The Lakers also with a sub. Hayes, he's checked in for Davis. 107 left to play here in the third. Now, here's Watson. Nothing on the board. Murray left side. And no good as it rattles out. And the pressure he put on that shot forced the miscue. Those are all the little things about effort there. He just gets out there and contests, and that's just enough. LeBron outside. Just five to shoot. Los Angeles needs to get off a shot here. Hachimura, no good. Well, that's the only way to take him out of his comfort zone from that range. Get right up in the jersey, force him off the spot. Two second difference between shot clock and game clock. Now Murray. After Naji. The Nuggets with another miss. And so it's Los Angeles. Holding on to an eight-point lead, heading into the break. Shooting the ball so well in this one. A great performance from the field. And don't go away. We'll be right back.
in a moment now as we take a look at our State Farm assists of the game. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter for him. Well, there's a way to break down the defense with the handle, but you can do it with the pass. Prime example of that right there. And this is it. Glad to have you along for this fourth and final quarter. The Nuggets trail by eight and on the court for the Lakers to start the fourth. Vanderbilt and Davis man the post box. Then it's Rui Hachimura. Then it's Gabe Vincent. And it's Reeves in at the two spot. Look at the defense on display there from Davis. Lines up the shot and with perfect timing swats it away. Here's Reeves. He's guarded by Caldwell Pope. Reeves the pass to Davis. Shoots it up. Reeves can't hit. Here's Najee. Murray with it. And the pass to Najee. Here's Porter. Count the bucket coming off a perfectly placed decision. And that's now seven points for Michael Porter. Lakers leading by six. A few possessions into the fourth quarter, just over a minute played. Here's Vincent. It's rebounded by Najee. And Murray's got the ball here for the Denver Nuggets. Here in the fourth quarter, their defense has been very strong, allowing no baskets. Here's Reeves. Just over a minute and a half played here in the fourth. And stolen by Murray. A rebound by the Lakers. They've led by as much as 10. Here's Vincent. He's covered by Murray. Hachimura against Porter. Lock at six. Vincent up top. He's covered by Murray. And they'll get another chance. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the five. And fighting through the foul that time as AD was able to put that shot up. And a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Lakers. And guys, how about the unselfishness and all about working that ball around, shifting the defense, and just seeking out the best shot? Well, the three-point shot has been absolutely huge for them this entire game. And let's be honest, you have to knock down threes to win games these days. And that one falls for Anthony Davis. Jokic, he's checked in for Denver. Prince has checked in for the Lakers. Throws good for Davis. They're doing a better job of working themselves to the line here in the second half. Denver calls timeout. And they just can't seem to get going offensively. Yeah, they're like a four-day-old soda right now, just flat. They're missing shots left and right and just not playing their best. It's time now to hear from our Hall of Fame reporter, David Aldrich. What's the latest, David? Well, Kevin, I was able to listen in on what Denver's coach was going over with his team. Now he's encouraging them to keep attacking in the paint. He said, when we get inside, you score. Simple as that. Keep attacking and don't settle for anything that's not at the rim. Kevin, back to you. Thanks, David. Porter, bounce pass. Here's Murray. No place jumper from the free throw line. And the effort offensively from Jamal pays off that time. Lakers leading by six. Pass to Reeves. And we're about three minutes into the fourth quarter. And that one is off. Ice D from Porter. Well, there's more he could have done in this game for sure, but it hasn't kept them from pulling ahead. Murray left side. Back to Jokic. Being a 
impressive inside. Yeah, that was the third straight high percentage look the defense has allowed. The, the defenders have got to start putting bodies on bodies. Vincent with it. Hurry on him. The offensive rebound. And Davis puts it in. I like seeing AD attack the offensive glass. He uses his length so well, just so long. The Nuggets trail by six. Murray outside. Inside. Here's Jokic. And Davis pulls it down. Davis has got double digit rebounds now in the game. Pass to Reeves. And the foul on Jamal Murray. That is his first foul of the game. Jamal and the Lakers with some changes. LeBron comes in for Torian Prince. And it's Russell in for Vincent. Coming on to the floor for the Lakers. LeBron James. D'Angelo Russell. James up top. Here's Reeves. Back to LeBron. Just five on the clock. Over Porter. James, no good. Nuggets have gone three of seven from the floor in the fourth. That's a 42% mark in the quarter. Russell against Murray. Count the basket and the foul. That one on Davis. He's simply staying aggressive right now, and Jokic is ready to shoot at the biggest moment. Defensive foul. Anthony Davis. That's his second personal foul. First team foul. At the line for your Nuggets, Nikola Jokic. Free throw, good, Jokic. And you just knew he wasn't going to miss that one. Not with so much riding on. LeBron kicks to Russell. Back to LeBron. LeBron powering inside. And this is who LeBron James is, an incredible leader. When the game is tight, this guy willing to step up. Here's Jokic. Good, and the assist goes to Murray. 20 points for Jokic. Jokic stepping up big time here. And here is LeBron. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. That one on Porter. Second best way to play in attack mode and get to the line. seen this. LeBron at the line in a big moment. Second one is good. And both at the line. And it's a five-point game. And just like that, this game is a two-possession affair. And so it's Murray who brings the ball up for Denver. Nuggets ball. Giving up just eight points in the fourth quarter. Time called here. The Nuggets decide to talk it over. They trail by five. 51 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Shooting performance. 
Great call to keep running all those sets for. Here's Murray. To the paint. Here's Jokic. Over Davis. It drops. What a beautiful shot to bring him to within three. And Jokic just making this look way too easy. We can probably expect to see him slow it down now. Yeah, I think you want to milk your possessions. Look, give LeBron the ball and get out of the way. LBJ again. Denver calls timeout. Denver calls time. They're behind by five. 29 seconds left in the fourth. Fans, please welcome to the floor your Nuggets Dance Team. Nine seconds left to play here in the fourth. Murray kept alive. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. And this is the challenge Jokic possesses for opposing teams. He's so good at getting these types of calls. Nikola Jokic. First free throw is good, and that shrinks the margin to just four. At the line, Jokic can be very productive. Fouling him might not have been the right move here. And Jokic drops them both. Clutch. Those free throws turn this into a one-possession ball game. Nuggets. And that's an intentional foul. Michael Porter Jr. That's his third personal foul. Fourteen foul. Shooting for Los Angeles. LeBron James. Taking two shots. It's the first that gives them a four-point cushion. So both free throws are good, and it's a five-point game. 23 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Murray for three. It's good, and he has brought them to within two points. He's a guy that lives for a big moment like that. Great focus and courage in the clutch. And there's the intentional foul. No choice but to stop the clock here. Yeah, that's right. No other option but to foul. D'Angelo Russell at the line for two. He drops the first one and that makes it a three-point lead. And typically, he's reliable from the line. Let's see if Russell can come up here big for his team. So he goes two for two at the lock, and it's a four-point ball game. Ooh, I think that's a wrap, and I can tell you, you can't have more pressure-packed free throws than the ones that are going to seal the game. Remember that one. Guys, a difference maker. I'm wondering, is that the biggest shot of the game? They foul intentionally. That's what they have to do at this point. Team is in the penalty. At the line for the Lakers. LeBron James. Taking two shots. Right on the first, and that will put them up by two. So he gets them both, and it's a three-point game. Huge free throws. Bumps the lead up to three, and now they simply have to guard against the three ball. A three and nothing but a three will do here. Now nah, this is Nuggets. all from the perimeter and outside the arc here. And now an intentional foul. They need the ball back as soon as possible. At the line for the Lakers. LeBron James. the first one and that 
gives them a four-point cushion. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a five-point game. And so the Lakers take the win. This was a hard-fought, well-earned victory for him, Greg. They really had to work for this win. That's another point. I mean, you know, week 13, you might have buckled at the end with the crowd amped up, everyone in the building kind of rooting against you. But they stood tall and pulled it out. Well said. That concludes the first game of the NBA season. For Brett Berry, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.